<laughs> so here is the spreadsheet from the North Wing project. Um, one thing I should notice actually, or I should note before we jump into it is if the sample file for this, um, uh, the actual Excel spreadsheet, as well as some other documents from this project, um, if you're interested in getting those, um, you actually can um, as a member of the BIM After Dark community. And so um, if you don't know what that is, that is a private community that's online that um, we use for office hours, courses, um, general community engagement, as well as sample files and projects like this, um, including a template. So anyways, all that's to say, if you're interested, um, feel free to head on over to community.bimafterdark.com and take a look. Um, if you're interested in getting this actual spreadsheet that I'm walking through today and the Revit model, you can actually get them as members of the community. So here's the spreadsheet. Um, and as you can see, what we'll do is we'll first start with the total down at the bottom, and then we'll sort of roll up and talk about how all these numbers came together. So on this side here, um, the estimate side of things, um, that is what I was quote unquote estimating. Um, and then the actual cost is what I was tracking here on the right hand side. And you can see this spreadsheet also tracks the variance between what what I thought it was gonna cost versus what it actually cost. And then was it above or below 